Okay. Okay. Um, if you were from Kentucky, would your name be Kentucky or Alabama? Would be Alabama? No, it would be no, Florida. Florida. <laughs> Is there any inspiration for that other than the state? You just um, felt yeah, like you um, got flow rider, like surfing I mean, or anything? No, nah, you know, just definitely, you know, the flow representing my more melodic style rider, representing okay. the fact that I like to ride the beat as I, you know, get on it. Okay, yeah. cool. Um, also, this is the Hot 100. What makes, like, what do you think is hot? What I think is hot? Yeah, what do you think is hot? I mean, stepping out, you know, with your swag up. You know, I think my glasses are hot today. I think <laughs> my song is hot, good feeling, which is dropping Tuesday, you know, um, much love to Etta James, who's featured on the uh, record, you know, legendary Etta James, um, Dr. Luke, who produced the record. So, I mean, I think that's hot. You, have, you worked with some great people in the past. Do you have any products coming up that you are working with? Anyone? Oh, yeah. My, um, actually, my album is uh, coming out later on this year. So far, like I said, I'm dropping a single uh, Tuesday. Good feeling. Very excited about that. Um, um, far as features on the album, so far I have a, a young lady by the name of Sia who's on a record that's like crazy. I'm pretty sure I should be going and get me an MTV award next year. <laughs> so what about working with Eddie James? What was that like? Oh uh, man, you know, um, I actually got a chance to watch the uh, movie Cadillac Records and I seen, you know, Beyonce portraying her. So I, that's that's what made me more familiar with her artistry and everything. But um, the record that I got is crazy and I'm happy that she, you know, cleared the sample. What did you think of Beyonce's big reveal today? Oh man, that was a, a, a moment that she um, cherished for life, you know, just doing that. Um, definitely, I mean, I just congratulate them, you know, um, definitely, uh, she's a great artist and everything, so I mean, look forward to nothing but big and better things for her. Would you want to work with Beyonce and Jay? Oh yeah, most definitely. Were you like, I mean, to be a godfather, think about Flo Rida as a name for the baby? <laughs> I'm pretty sure they, they have somebody. <laughs> <laughs> Who are your dream artists to work with? Dream artist? Um, I'm a big fan of Outkast. Oh, cool. That's yeah. Was, who was your favorite performance tonight? I liked it. Uh, I like Kanye and uh, Jay Z. That Jeffrey. was that was hot. And Chris Brown did his thing. Yeah. Is there yeah. any truth to them being in a feud, Jay Z and Kanye? I'm not. I know nothing about that. <laughs> as much as you know, this evening is about you know divas. Do you have a favorite diva, like a musical diva that you you were speaking about at James before? But do you have somebody that you look at and you know they might have a bit of a personality? Um. I mean, early, late, what? Now? Anything. Early, um, late. Anything that anybody that you look as far as like a woman singer that you look to. That you oh know yeah, I'm a big fan of Lauren Hill. Lauren Hill. Yeah, yeah. Why so? I mean, um, she's versatile. She's one of those artists that are very passionate about their craft, and you know she takes it very serious and has worldwide exposure, and, and she's true to her artistry. I'm just wondering, um, first day of school, everyone's had these like that. Have you had an embarrassing moment on your first day of school? Uh, fortunately, I haven't. Unfortunately, <laughs> I a lot of times here. I didn't show up the first day because I always wanted to, you know, uh, just it have a big grand interest when I come to school. <laughs> uh, Little Wayne said before he would collaborate with Justin Bieber. Would you collaborate with him, or that any artist you would never work with? I can't say never because I mean to get to the status of even being an artist, you have to work very hard and have something unique about yourself. But um, definitely, I wouldn't mind working with Justin Bieber. Yeah. Well, yeah. What do you kind of you know, do together? I mean, he'll do his thing, he'll do his singing, and I'll do my rap thing. Yeah. yeah. Wait, you have to explain this more. Do you have anything in mind particularly? Right. Because when he does his thing, and you do your rap thing, how does that mesh? Because for Ryder and Justin Bieber, I can't work that out in my head. I mean, I mean, it, it works hand in hand. He has real wild fans, and I have real wild fans. So, I mean, it makes the job easy. Small world, after all. Um, um, as far as uh, an official date for my album, you can go to officialflow.com. Cool. Yeah. How'd you spend your summer besides uh, working on the album? I mean, oh, man, I was all over the world. Yeah. Summer vacation? What'd you do? It was just like a vacation, just doing the shows, being in San Pay, going to Italy and everything like that. You know, I got two for one. Highlight would be what? I mean, the place that you never thought you might be or, you know, just the moment. And then... When I actually got a chance... Um, just being a Sandro Pay and going to Ibiza, yeah. Is that the fact that they never wear tops on the beaches? Is that what this is? <laughs> oh, that was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> that was crazy. Yeah. Thank you so much. All right, now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.